Hi, I'm Dave Epstein. Welcome to this edition of Growing Wisdom. And of course, you know, winter, the colder months, is a time when there's not a lot blooming outside in many parts of the country. So no matter where you are, I want to talk about one of my favorite plants to bring inside, and that's the calla lilies. And the great thing about calla lilies is they continue to bloom for long periods of time, so weeks and weeks on end, as long as they're happy. There are a few things you want to keep in mind to keep your calla lily happy. Number one, it likes a sunny location. So put your plant in a place where it does get full sun. The plant will go dormant after a period of time. It enters a period of what we call dormancy. It's just resting. Don't think that your plant has died. When your plant's in bloom like this, what you want to do is keep it evenly moist but not wet. If the plant feels moist to the touch, don't water it. When the soil begins to dry out, give it a little bit of water. Your calla lily will tend to put up new flowers for a long period of time. Eventually, as long as you're watering it correctly, you'll notice the leaves beginning to yellow. Now it's beginning to enter that period of dormancy. It's going to sleep. In many parts of the country, that tends to happen during the winter months. If it does so, move the plant into a dark, cool location, similar to what you do with an amaryllis bulb. During the period of dormancy, you really want to let the soil get quite dry. In a colder climate, if you're growing it outside, dig up the bulbs, store it inside for the winter, and then you can replant it. You can also grow them as a house plant. They're actually very versatile. There's not many plants where you can grow them inside and outside, and they're relatively successful. Even inside, the plant may go dormant. If it does so, let it dry out, dig it up out of the pot, put in fresh soil, and start all over again. The plant will tend to actually get bigger and bigger even in the pot. Notice here in this pot we have these little teeny leaves starting to come out. The plant's expanding itself. That's why they make such great gifts because they'll continue to flower and grow for long periods of time. Calla lilies not only come in white, they come in a variety of colors. As a matter of fact, here at Berry's Greenhouse in Natick, Mass, where I'm doing the video, we've got some that are orange, yellow, purple, and even pink. In addition to this video, there's a lot of great resources out on the internet about calla lilies. So calla lilies, a great indoor plant, a great outdoor plant, and certainly a great gift any time of the year. For Growing Wisdom, I'm Dave Epstein.